What's up guys? Welcome back to the Let's Play of Dark Souls. So, <clears throat> I forgot I had uh, some extra souls, went ahead and used them and got our endurance to 24 and we are literally just a few decimals shy of being able to fast roll. So, one more point into that should get us there <coughs> and then the rest will go into health from there on throughout the rest of the game. Um, I need to put on the Sunlight Maggot hat. There we go. And from here, we need to head on to the Tomb of Giants. So, go ahead, start running. Shield on up. Prepare for the wheels. They will be coming, you can see. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yep. See what I mean? The wheels have arrived. Just keep running. Ignore the wheels. Ignore the wheels. Just, just keep running. Should have avoided them. Fall on down here. We gotta go get the bonfire of the Tomb of the Giants, which is not too far, but we'll go and grab it. And down here, we should get our crystal, or not crystal, but the um, <clears throat> Divine Ember. So we can finally finish leveling up our Claymore and max that out. Uh, just real quick, I'm gonna go see if there's anything over here I need to grab. I don't know this area too well. I don't know what all is in here. Okay, let's see. I have no idea where we're going. Okay, item. Soul of a Proud Knight. And then that falls back down to where the wheels were. So, grab the soul item. And keep going back to where we were. You can see there's another item up there. I'm gonna try to get that. I'm gonna try to get as much as I can. Break that. Uh, that leads down. The one that we want is right over here. Where is it? I guess that was it. Okay. So yeah, this little one is the one we're gonna want. So take this one. Tomb of the Giants. We have finally made it. So while we are here. Okay, so there's enemy number one. Yeah, I mean, you can see they kind of... They hit like a motherfucker. So, take them on out. Shouldn't give you too much trouble. Pretty beefy boys. Nothing over here. Keep scouring. There is that item right there. We will get to that later. You can see there's like another one over there. Head on down first right here and okay well he's gonna fall to his death so that's fine with us proud night soul go ahead and grab that back over here see we can't get it and then we're getting shot at by dudes over here so yeah, you can see his eyes right there shooting at us fall on right here oh you're still alive huh I do not want to die here. Okay, you fall to your death, and then one more faggot. Take you out. Heal on up. Should be pretty good from here. And now, we need to head down. Down this one. And there's patches. So we're getting close to the bonfire. Once you find patches, you it's a good indicator that you're pretty close. Um, actually, we'll go ahead. Before we do that, we'll get the bonfire. Just in case any bullshit happens. Fall right here. And here we go. Go ahead and sit on down. Prepare our stuff. Break some bones and climb back up. Where are you at? There you are. What? You again? Well, well. You've been a stranger. It's good to see you well, my darling. All right. You came at the perfect time. There's a fine stash of treasure right down that hole. I found it first, but we're friends now. I'll split it with you, in any case. Have a look. 
it'll shimmer you blind. <laughs> Patches does what Patches does. Walk over here for a cutscene. <laughs> this is what I do, my friend. The trinkets I'll be stripping off your corpse. That's the real treasure. <laughs> Classic patches. So go ahead and grab all this stuff. <clears throat> Proud Knight Soul. Skull Lantern if you didn't have it. Proud Knight. Good few items. And we will make our way back to up back up to where he is in just a minute. Gotta figure out where we are first. White Titanite. Let's see those little guys spawn. Yeah, here they are. Take them on out. They're not too bad. Uh, they can hurt. If you get hit by them, they definitely will hurt, but just a little heads up. But one little strong attack from us does them pretty well. How do I get out of here? I can't remember. Uh, so it's not that way. I do hear a dog, too, which is... Very not good. Oh, there you are. Okay, so talk to her. You're no hollow, are you? Thank goodness. Please be careful. There are two fierce hollows not far from here. They were once brave knights, and my former escorts. Who would let such strong spirits be hollowed so? Heavens, is there nothing? Nothing at all to be done. So she's going to tell you to be careful. The two Claire guys are right over here. Here's one. Take out one of them. And the other one, we can easily kill. There we go. Easy enough, am I right? Kill them, talk to her again. You banished those oh, shit. Hollows, did you? <laughs> There we go. Okay. You banished those two hollows, did you? It pains me to think of the trouble my failings have caused. I am certain that both Vince and Nico are grateful to you. Thank you so very much. Here. These belonged to them. You deserve them more than I. Punishment? I am certain that... Okay. So she should return to the Undead Parish. And we can get miracles from her now. Uh, I think I'm right about that, but we'll just have to see. But uh, from here... God, I still get turned around in here, even though I have no idea where I'm going. Uh, there's the three souls. So this way. You gotta go through this way. We'll go find Patches again and talk to him here in just a minute. Skelly, take them out. White Titanite Chunk, go ahead and pick that up. The ladder. Oh, and I can hear the bonfire, so we are getting close. Climb back on up this. Fake wall. And here, I believe, is where we will get the. Okay, so that's how we get back over there. Yeah, we can see the bonfire right there. See it? Uh, over here, I believe, is where we are going to get the large divine ember. If I can figure out how to get up there. Okay. Just trying to make sure I know where I'm going and what's all around. So see, we got one guy right here, and we got a skeleton shooting at us, too. Go ahead and take him out. Take him out. Climb on up. 
And we'll come back down there to where that little thing was in just a second. You can see there's an item right there. We're still getting shot at, so we will grab that. Um, Crawled Night Soul. Go ahead and grab that. Oh, shit. I thought you died. You want to calm down with that hopping and skipping and shit? Give him a boop. Give him another boop. Coolio. Alright, and from here, is there another ladder? Yes, there is. Okay. Go on up here. Climb up here. It's a whole area, I'm telling you. Like, this area is just one whole mess. Three Eyes of Death. Very useful if you're going to need them for Nito's Covenant. Uh, from here, we'll go back down. Oh, did I miss that item? Shit, I think I did. Hold on, let me check real quick. Pretty sure I did. Yeah, I did. Okay, let me grab that real quick and then we'll fall on down. Crowd Night Soul. Fall on down, take the damage. Sippy on up. And right over here. Here we go. This is where we need to be. Jesus Christ, come on, dude. So yeah, you can see there's... Yeah, tons of dudes in here, so... It is a whole thing, absolutely. Uh, the problem is... Most of these guys, we can't really lock onto them or see them uh, because of this nonsense. So, thinking what I'm going to do is... God, I really wish... I might just have to wing it. Huh. Okay, they're all over here. Take out one. It's so hard to see. Uh, we can snipe these guys. The way we have to do it is basically just like... It's literally just a matter of like looking at them and pinning them down. Let's see, there's two guys right here. Okay. Oh. Here's another one. It's very, very annoying. Uh, we're just trying to be very meticulous about this just because of where we are. So there should be some more dudes in here. Yeah, we got one of them coming right now. Aggro him over here. Get him. Other guy should be coming. Take him on out. Sippy on up. Soul of a Brave Warrior. Uh, there might be a few more... I guess not. Okay, cool. Large Divine Ember. Finally got it. So that's what we need. After that, <clears throat> we can head on back, rest of the bonfire real quick. Might have enough souls. Eh, maybe we have a level. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell. Um, we'll see. I feel like we're not going to have enough, honestly, so we might have to just wait, but... That's where we came up, so... Walk on over here. Patches should be right here. Oh, you! I... Well, 
Let's just calm down. Talk about things. I'm calm. I did you wrong, but I didn't mean it. These temptations, they can, well, overcome me. You know what I mean, don't you? Please, forgive me. You and me, we're jolly undead outcasts, aren't we? Oh, brilliant. A second chance. Wonderful. I had a feeling you'd understand. I did. But uh, if I were in your shoes, ooh, who knows what I'd have done. But now we're friends again. Eh? <laughs> yeah, so forgive him if you want. You can kill him if you want. I'm going to forgive him. He will be useful later. Uh, from here... Trying to remember where to go or what's in here. Uh, yeah, dog. Okay. So dogs are annoying. Um, hit them with lightning. And then be prepared to get out of here. Yeah. Dogs are very, very annoying. And these guys can kill you easily. They hurt like a motherfucker. Uh, they go crazy. They're just not fun to deal with at all. So just a heads up. Put through the fog wall. We should have a black knight in here. I think I hear him. Thought I heard him. Yeah, there you are. Come on, get over here. Try to get behind him. drop from here we have another dog uh, we do have the archer what I would recommend first is just trying to take care of the dog aggro him over here fight him where the archer can't hit you you gotta be kidding me man come on on over here okay so we can see there's nothing over here there is another dog coming up there we go soul of a brave warrior and there should be another doggo yeah right here so what I would recommend lightning if you have it Take him out. Yeah, these guys are wild and they will kill you if you're not careful. So from here, I believe we go on in here. Yeah, see, there's another dog right there. Get some lightning. gonna come up and kill us. Here we go. Take him on out. We're gonna go this way real quick. Get the effigy shield. Run on back. Who is that? What the heck? Do you see that? It's a player. That's funny. I was just like, what the heck? He's like clear as can be. That's where he came from. So we go over here. Not that way. It's this way. One down. Gonna have more dudes to deal with. Another one right here. Take him on out.
Here's the bonfire right there. Wait, is this the same bonfire? Oh no, it's another one. Huh. Okay. I kind of forgot that. I didn't realize there were two. Let's go ahead and repair our stuff. Take care of that. Uh, let me see if I have enough uh, souls to level up. It would be very nice to get this if we can. I have a feeling it's not going to be enough. Didn't use all of them either. I needed to use all of them. Two brave warrior souls, so just maybe. I think we have enough. And we do. Cool. So endurance, get that on up. Put me loaded at 78. We are sitting right now at level 93. Vitality at 20, 14, endurance is at 25, 16, 40, 12, 8, and 40. And I believe now we should be able to get our fast roll. Yeah, we do. We have our fast roll. Very, very good. So from here... Okay, you can see the dog is right there. We're not going to fight the dog. Going to go down... Just trying to make sure no one's following me. I don't want to be followed. White Titan Knight Chunk. Oh, we are being followed. This is bad. Yeah, see what I mean? Like, these guys can kill you easily. They can very easily kill you. Not fun to deal with at all. From here. Okay, more dogs. Yeah, you can see them. So the strategy is going to be to lightning and then back up. Take care of one. Take care of the other one. I believe there's another one. Yeah, see, if you back up too much, you won't be able to lock on. Oh, shit. He surprised me. I didn't even think he'd notice. Alright. I think that's all of them. Right here we have an item. Let me grab this. Silver Brave Warrior. See that path that goes down? This is just where we were. Fighting those doggos. So now it branches off again. Gorgeous view. There's Ash Lake. Ash Lake, or whatever you call it. I don't even remember the name of it, but yeah. Uh, from here, take the ladder on down. We are getting close. Getting close to Nito. I believe it's just this way. Yeah, it looks like it. So go ahead, run on over here. Run on over here. Ah. Gorgeous view. Yeah, it's just like Telling you what's over there. Uh, Leroy is right here. He will invade if you're human. And we're gonna die. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Alright, we'll turn human and get back over there. That was stupid of me. Try to kill Leroy again. That was pretty stupid. I knew rolling and dodging was going to be kind of iffy on that little slope, but. Alright, so we should be able to get through here pretty easily. If you want, you can just kind of sprint past all this. There we go. So 
so he should invade again. At least I believe. Since we are human. Okay, yeah, he will, so. Go ahead and knock him out. There we go. Easy enough. Drop some shit ton of souls. Get his stuff, get the humanity, the grant, and the sanctus. Now we have a lot of souls, so at this point, uh, we should be able to just take off our sunlight thing, put back on our witch hat, or whatever you want to use. Um, sorry, I said witch hat, I meant the crown of dark sun. Throw that on. Uh, we have our poise ring. Nito's not too bad. He can be kind of crazy. Um, beyond that, I mean, it's really just a matter of... The only reason I've got the poise ring on is for the skeletons, because there are going to be skeletons there fighting with him. I think we'll be okay. Uh, I don't think I'm going to lose these souls. Hopefully not. I mean, I can run back over here pretty easily, just like I did, in case I die. But from here, we got to run past a bunch of... pinwheels. You'll see what I mean here in just a second. See what I mean? Yeah, two skeletons here. Run past them. I'm really not trying to mess with them at all. So here's the pinwheel area. So uh, this area, you got a bunch of little skellies. They will follow you. They'll try to kill you. My best advice is just to shit and get. Go over here, grab the item if you want. Soul of a hero. See how much damage they do. Go on in. Evade the pinwheels. And this is where the boss fight happens. So, gonna sip on up. Fall down. We're gonna take fall damage too. We'll sip up again. And here we go for Nito. boys and girls the man himself so yeah we take damage go ahead and just heal on up he will shove his sword into the ground and hit you from afar with it and there are skeletons in here just be cautious uh, really it's just a matter of trying to bait out his aoe so he can kill the skeletons around him He's gonna do it. Dodge that. As soon as he shoves it into the ground, you can dodge it. Okay, now he's gonna do his AoE, so this is where you want to back up. Go on in, get some damage. He's gonna do it again. Back on up. Get on in there. He's gonna do it again. This is what you want to do. You just want to bait out his AOE and have the skeletons die from it. It's honestly just the easiest strat. Have him kill his guys for you. And there you go. Grave Lord Nito is down. Easy peasy, right? Get the Lord Soul. Humanity. And with that, we should have a bonfire and be able to get the hell out of here. There we go. So light that on up. Uh, real quick, we're going to take our 
soul items. Use that too, and we should maybe get two levels here. Yeah, maybe not. Cutting it kind of close. Let's go, uh, we'll go talk to Frampt. We gotta go do some lore stuff anyway, so let's warp on back to Firelink. We'll sell some stuff to Framp, go to the Lord Vessel, put all the souls in, and then the next episode after this, we are gonna be taking on the DLC. Which, that's gonna be fun. I haven't done that in forever either. Gonna sit down, down, get our 20 Estus. Go find Framp, tell him we kicked everybody's ass. He's gonna be like, hurrah, you're the true warrior, blah, blah, blah. He's taking a nap as per usual. Wake his no, ass up. No, I'm fine. I'm do not. He's gonna be like, oh, what do you need? Come on, brother. I am pleased. Alright, so we're gonna feed him some stuff. Uh humanity. Go ahead and give him most of those. Purging stone. Uh I don't know if I'm gonna get cursed later. I'll hold on to that. Let's see, what else can I sell you? The grant, we'll get rid of that. I'll go get rid of that. Skull answer, we'll need that. Energy shield, get rid of that. Sanctus, get rid of that. Oh, uh, what else? Is there anything else? Guess not. Okay. So now we'll talk to him. The beings who possess these souls have outlived their usefulness, or have chosen the path of the wicked as the primordial serpent. I implore you to defeat them and claim their souls. Let there be no guilt. Let there be no vacillation. All right, so we're going to warp. Very well. Then stay still for a moment. Going to go and put all the Lord souls in the Lord vessel. And then we'll level up and end the episode after we take care of those levels. And then... I'm gonna have to figure out how to get Dust to spawn. I don't remember how to get her to spawn, so I gotta figure that out before we do the DLC too. Boop. Drop us on down. Come on over here. Sit. I'll level up. Yeah, we got two levels. Perfect. So uh, we could keep putting into dexterity, but you can see it's starting to get minuscule. Same with Faith. Uh, we just want to start dumping stuff into Vitality. We really need some health. Uh, offer Souls Lord Vessel. Go ahead and put all these in. Trick, am I right? So at this point, you could, if you've been following along as like using this as a guide, you could go that way and beat Gwyn right now and, you know, end the game if you wanted to. But we need to do the DLC. So I'm going to call this episode here and I will see you guys in the next one when we finally start heading on to the Artorias DLC.